<laughs> Speaking of science, what does it say tonight? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Well, it says that we're going to enter December tomorrow, and that's the start of meteorological winter. All right. But it's going to remain quite warm, which is typical for the East Texas standards for us. <laughs> we're just going to trend a little bit warmer. We'll talk more about our forecast here in just a moment. But today is the end of the Atlantic Basin hurricane Good. season. We'll give you a look at the tropics right now. Things are quiet for us here at this particular moment, and that is a good sign. There are some showers and thunderstorms. Of course, we can't discount all of that, but that's in general typically what takes place in the Atlantic and also near the equator. What a season that it was. Take a look here at the name storms that we had this year. We went all the way down through all 21 name storms, and we ended up having also a couple of major hurricanes. So 21 name storms, seven of those became hurricanes, four of those becoming major hurricanes, including Hurricane Ida, which went on record for the fifth strongest hurricane to make landfall in the United States. Remember Ida, battering portions of southeast Louisiana once it made landfall there back in uh, the portions of August into early September. Third most active season on record. Here's the outlook as we move into the winter months, December, January and February. When we tally it all up, looking like below normal precipitation for us and above normal on our temperatures. That does not mean that we won't get some cold air outbreaks to move in and the chances of some wintry weather. Yes, all of that has to come into play together, but at the end of it, we'll probably trend below normal on that precipitation. All right, today we enjoyed sunshine and we enjoyed a really nice sunset. You see those hues of purple from our Longview Tower Cam. Really great shot of the sun going down this evening. Skies right now are mostly clear. Today we reached the lower and even some mid 70s this afternoon. Right now we've dropped into the middle and the low 50s. Even a few 40s, including Henderson at 49, 58 in Jacksonville, 57, the temperature in Mount Pleasant. Humidity values are increasing for tonight. They are near 90% in deep east Texas. So I think initially we're going to see some brief patchy fog, but look what happens into tomorrow morning. Notice how the clouds start to move in a bit more. We'll see these clouds fill in to start our Wednesday morning. We'll begin in the upper 40s to the low 50s, but in the afternoon we should see a mixture of clouds and sunshine. And once again, mid 70s in the afternoon, temperatures easily about 10 degrees above above where we should be for this time of the year. Let's look at future casts. Here are those morning clouds that we'll see on Wednesday and notice how they clear out into the afternoon. No big problem there. Thursday, I think we'll still have a few clouds, but no big concern. But starting on Friday, here comes some greater moisture and we'll start to introduce some rain chances. It looks like an initial batch of rain anywhere from near San Antonio, perhaps on the west side of Houston, but that's most likely where it'll stay. We'll get some showers here Friday night going into Saturday and then during the day Saturday a few scattered showers also possible, but then we await for this cold front to move in the front kind of meanders around the uh, Texas Oklahoma area and maybe not arriving until late Sunday into Monday, probably a better chance of rain probably Sunday night going into Monday before temperatures cool down for early next week. So middle 70s expected very warm conditions for us. We will have a southwest to a southerly breeze. Some hit and miss shower chances for the weekend. Definitely a lot more clouds and you'll feel the humidity for the weekend. That cold front Sunday night drops us to the low 60s on Monday and then we'll start to warm back up for next week. Deep East Texas, similar forecast here. Cool mornings warming up in the afternoon. You too have some rain chances for the weekend. All right, coming to sports.